they unleashed hell on the village they snatched women's gold chains looted ration from shops and robbed jewelry true shivaji maharaj bhakts would never do such things these were goons this is what a local from kolhapur's gajapur village told the quint on 14 july hundreds gathered at the foothills of kolhapur's vishalgad fort to protest against illegal encroachments on the fort by the end of the day homes and shops in the nearby gajapur village were looted a mosque was attacked and scores of locals were injured shocked residents recalled horrors while speaking to the quint protesters had gathered at the foothills of the vishalgad fort after a call by former mp sambhaji raj who has been a vocal critic of illegal encroachments on the historic vishalgad fort but what was claimed to be a peaceful protest allegedly had several brandishing sticks swords and knives ahead of the arrival of sambhaji raj at the site some miscreants allegedly pelted stones at a darga near the fort which escalated the situation the police then barred entry to the fort but the wrath of the agitated protesters was faced by gajapur village at the foothills of the fort one of the locals told the quint my old parents were at home they escaped to the forest that is right behind our house and hid there for an hour i run a grocery shop here they just looted it they ran away with cans of oils rice packets of chips whatever they could lay their hands on i had a small fridge in the shop they dragged it out and trashed it another woman said we hid in the kitchen and remained quiet but then we heard banging on the front door they were banging for about 3 to 4 minutes we jumped out of the kitchen window which opens on the side of the forest and ran as fast as we could with our toddlers the handling of the situation by the police has come under question from several quarters including political leaders while sambhaji raj condemned the violence and called it the police and administration's failure many have demanded action against him Local Hindutva outfits and Muslim bodies also question the police's alleged shortcomings. Getting stories from the ground takes hard work, time and effort, but we want to keep getting forth such videos that need to be heard and stories that must be told, and for that we need your support. So become a member of the Quint, support us and help us get you stories that matter.